Uh oh. Uh oh. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> oh, that would have been super. What a shame, Beach. Oh, I'm talking to no one again. I love these sun lanes. Why are you dumping rubbish here? I'm a jerk. I'm lazy. I don't care. <laughs> Mummy still clicks. Martin is the largest town in the Rangatiki district. It was established in 1866 when local landowners sold sections for shops and houses. Martin serviced the Manawatu plains with butter, wool and flour with its fertile farming region. And then, in 1878, the arrival of the railway led to rapid growth, which added other industries such as engineering and sawmilling. Buildings. Don't know what he is. Center. Hmm, nice name. I'm creating the slash. John Turkington Forestry. Pick. Oh, there's the slash. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's what they don't want. Big picture though. Could be old post office. And a hotel. And a modern hotel. Cool. think it is? <gasps> it is! How gorgeous! I might break it though. What a cute little park! I'll go this side. Oh, you're going that side. Oh, I can't get up now. I'm up this side. Oh, yay! Oh, down! Yay! <laughs> hey, what does that say? We're the same height. That can't be right. <laughs> oh, that's fun, eh? Right, let's get off. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Thank you! <sighs> oh! Development Group would like to thank. Wow! And it's got all the names. Oh, that's beautiful. It does turn. Oh, 
Ooh, and this is lovely. What is this? Mountain Lions Club and Forest and Bird Society. Upgraded walkway. It's nice. We know it's a golden elm. Commemorating 50 years of lionism in Martin. Did you hear that, Fantail? Lionism. What do you reckon? It's not purposely built for people to walk on, is it? Is it? Oh, how neat. I think. Might be for the young ones though. Whoa. Oh man, it goes on and on. Really? Children's school. It's a school ground. More of an obstacle course for children. Oh, groovy. Oh, here's the school kids. Wonder which school it is. Wee, look at that. Oh, oh, it's a swing bridge, all right. Whoa, whoa. How neat, oh. <laughs> Whoops, I'll get out of your way. Let's have a look. Look at these plants beside it. Dahlias. This is beautiful. Ah, we came in the wrong way. Lost Acre, the bridge to know where that bridge was. <laughs> we should have come in that way. We weren't to know. Where are we? A road bridge. It's a road bridge, Bobby. Is it the end of our walk? Martin School or something. I've seen those pencils. I've got it on video. Rayona Park in Martin. Tiniest little park, but it's cute enough, isn't it? Just cute enough. smallest but steepest little bridges up and over. It's a dag. Oh you didn't even go around. You went around the bridge. <laughs> bye bye ducks. Bye bye. Thank you for showing me Fiona. Ha.
Wow. It's a big old building, eh? She's real big. Is he gone to the caravan park? What's the bit? What have you found? <laughs> Into the MCA. <laughs> The Martin Railway Station is now disused, except for an occasional excursion train. It opened in 1878 and closed in 2012. Rangatike. Is this still being used? We used to come here, didn't we? Pick kids up from train rides. It's not being used anymore. Ah. Oh. Subway, it's got a subway. Ah, it's shut, man. I don't want to go into the subway. Can't see in there, look. Oh, not even my own can reach around there. Dog on. Oh, that would have been super. What a shame, Beach. Oh, I'm talking to no one again. Welcome. I'm just sitting here. It's a shoe. Please pick up your dog's poop. It's clear to no. Powered by. Oh, I need my keys. Hurry up. Okay. <laughs> I love these signs. Why are you dumping rubbish here? I'm a jerk. I'm lazy. I don't care. <laughs> Mummy still clicks. Oh, that is gorgeous. Don't be a tosser. Take your rubbish with you. Oh, man. I love it. There's only Martin can do it, eh? We meant to be. 
How did he get through here? Oh, I see. Thank you. For three years, Martin was called Tutainui after the stream running through its centre. But in 1869, locals changed the name to Martin to honour the birthplace of Captain James Cook in Middlesbrough, marking his landing exactly 100 years earlier. It's thought the name change was influenced by the mistranslation of Tutai, meaning dung, and Nui, meaning large. A large poo when really it means a big gathering. Hmm. Nothing like what Gisborne Hawks Bay are getting at the moment. Or just had. I suppose this is high and swollen for this area. Poor old Hawke's Bay, it's even worse. Oh, look at that. Oh, nice. Rocks. And off it goes. Get onto those rocks. Oh, rock fall, it said. What did they do for? There you are. How neat. I'm just sitting here. Oh look, you can see it better. Huh. Martin's water supply has been an ongoing topic for their councillors. There was a saying in the 1940s that Martin has the only water supply where you get food and drink at the same time. As eels would slither out of household taps when the reservoir was low. Complaints over the years of Martin's water being unsuitable for drinking with algae blooms and deteriorating pipes are things the current council has inherited and are grappling with. Eating blackberries, heap of them. Sometimes you need to go and take a step back to see the truth around you. From a distance, you can tell. Version. Oh, sorry, duckies <gasps> and black swans. Hello, it's beautiful. Look at that little slipway, so cute. How lovely. This reservoir's got some hidden gems. Hey, okay. Dickens, it's February. I say it's Feb. <laughs> How sweet! Makes for a pleasant walk through the bush. Oh, I say, oh, what have we come to? Oh, that's that other slipway I took from the other angle. Oh, the little baby. Just a bit of information about some notable people who came from Martin. Bruce Beetham was a social credit politician. Israel Dagg 
who was an all black, and Sir Michael Fowler, who was an architect and the former mayor of Wellington. They all came from Martin. Do you have a clue what these men might be doing? Well drill, well drillers. A drilling. Ooh. Huh. Back in 1879, buckets of water from the Tutainui stream was how residents got their water. A local paper advised that if the water was a little thicker than usual, just strain it through a sock. And after a, the big fire of 1879 and the need for an efficient fire brigade is when the drilling company was formed. Here we are on the other side. We were over there before. Old school. Is that off for a reason? Is it not operational? It's pretty. Rangatiki District Council. Locked, hey? More pretty pictures. Beautiful. Beautiful kiriru, a beautiful tui. How lovely. Oh, oh, I looked at that side, didn't I? Oh, more blackberries beach. Look at those. How lovely. Heaps of them. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, sour. Ow. The world seems small. Hey. That's why. It's so Martin has drinking water all year round. Hundred year old facility. End of 2024. It'll be ready. 